only Bishop One students, Douglas Walker in chemistry, Madison Gafford in plant sciences, Jeffrey Smith in animal sciences, and Alex Marcello in medicine and health. Congratulations to those young scientists. Bishop Lynch varsity baseball grabbed the early lead against Mesquite and recorded a 9-0 victory on Saturday. With nine runs in the first three innings, Bishop Lynch left no doubt about the eventual outcome. Jacob Fortek had a two-run double in the first inning. Nick Robinson racked up two RBIs on two hits. Logan Lewis also had two hits for the Friars. Luke Stevens baffled Mesquite, striking out nine batters and pitching six innings of shutout ball. He only allowed four hits. The Friars' first district game is Tuesday, February 28th at BL vs. TCA at 7. Please come out and support the Friars. Congratulations to the powerlifting team for competing in the Colony High School Invitational this past Saturday. Senior Tony Dwyer placed fourth in the 220 weight class. This Saturday, the team will travel to Everman to complete in regionals. Congratulations to the Lady Friars basketball team for their defeat in the regional championship game. The girls defeated San Antonio Antonian this past Saturday with a score of 59-39. The top scorers of the night were senior Daniel Bradley with 21 points, 4 rebounds, and 2, two steals. Senior Aaron Hardick with 10 points, 3 rebounds, and 2 steals. And junior Leah Wildman with 7 points and 3 assists. The Lady Friars advance to the Final Four semifinals this Friday at Mansfield Timberview. The girls play Houston St. Pius and tip-off is at 4.30. The Lady Friars would really appreciate your support as they are just two games away from regaining their tradition of winning. So take the short trip to Mansfield. Set up a caravan even. Come out and support the Lady Friars in their quest to regain the state title. Uh, attention all students, this Wednesday, February 29th, Bishop Lynch will host 16 Jesuit University representatives on campus. They are scheduled to be in the atrium at 215. This is an excellent opportunity to visit these schools personally. Three Bishop Lynch students traveled to Hebron High School Saturday to participate in Area C Junior Classical League competition. This Junior Classical League is an organization for students of Latin, Greek, and classical civilization. Sophomore Jennifer Dorn won first place in Roman History Level 4 and second place in Reading Comprehension Level 4. Senior Lauren Paletti won second place in Ancient Geography Level 4 and third place in Latin Grammar Level 4. Sophomore Blake Karen took fourth place in Greek Derivatives Level 2. Congratulations to these outstanding students. Attention all National Honor Society members, please check the board or the Facebook page for the March tutoring schedule. Congratulations to the BL Varsity Tennis Team for defeating Prestonwood in their first district match. In singles play, junior Joey Molina won 6 and nothing and 6 and nothing, And freshman Luke Cannon won 6-1 and 6-2. In doubles play, junior Logan Keller and sophomore Miguel Fajardo won 6-0 and 6-1. Junior Jeffrey Smith and junior Ryan Laveri won a long three-set match, 6-3, 4-6, and 6-2. For the girls in singles play, sophomore Mallory Kenny lost a tough match, 6-2 and 6-2. And senior Savvy Garza won 6-0 and 6-0. In doubles play, senior Lauren Marson and junior Callie Cannon won 63 and 62. Senior Susan Price and junior Julianne Totes won 6 and 1 and 6 and nothing. In addition, varsity and JV matches single freshman Ben Yoxel won 6 and 1 and 6 and 1. And in doubles play, senior Eddie Earlbacher and junior Anthony Mendoza won 6 and nothing and 62. Freshman Christian Qu Cortez and freshman Luke Athis won 8 to 4. For the girls, junior so Sophie Athis won 8 to 3, and senior Emily Shagan lost a close match 8 to 5. In doubles play, senior Allie Woods and senior Ellie Logan won 6 to nothing and 6 to nothing. Senior Lauren D and sophomore Christine Marson 
won eight to two. Junior Jenny Corderas and senior Alyssa Coriath lost a lot lost a close match eight to five. The boys will scrimmage Jesuit Wednesday and varsity will play a district match versus Argyle Liberty this Thursday. This Wednesday we will be on the late arrival schedule with club meetings in the morning. The following clubs are scheduled to meet. Section A, Mira Quien Habla, Ferguson 102, JACA in 118, Bass Club 502, Latin Club 105, Student Foundation 110, Junior Girls Retreat 128, Habitat for Humanity 508, and Section B, Rachel's Challenge 121, French Honor Society 112A, Bass Club in 502, Amigos de la Finca, 120B, Musicians Club, 125, and Invisible Children in the Theater. The first water polo practice of the season will be this Wednesday at 415 at the Knights of Columbus Pool. There will be a bus going to the pool after school on Wednesday, returning after practice. That ends at 530. Tickets for the Blackfriars Spring Musical Guys and Dolls will go on sale today during all lunches. The cost is eight dollars per person. This is a sh this is a show you don't want to miss. So get your tickets early. We would like to wish a very happy birthday to Franklin Co., Katrin Corey, and Andrew Gober. And now for the joke of the day. Carlos, what do you call a fake noodle? I don't know, Salem. What do you call a fake noodle? An impasta. Ah! That's funny. That's funny. <laughs> if you have an announcement for BL Live, please send it to blive at bishoplunch.org. Please put only the dates of the announcements in the subject line. Announcements will run for two consecutive days. Bye. Bye.